Hey everyone, Mitchell Gould here, and in today's video, we're gonna be going over the Google Ads Ad Preview Tool. So you can use this tool to verify that your ads are showing, and when you use this tool, compared to if you're just searching on Google, you're not gonna impact your metrics. So if you're searching for a keyword where you think your ad should be showing, and you're doing that on Google, that can impact your click-through rate because you're getting impressions, but you're most likely not gonna be clicking on your ads. So you can use the Ad Preview Tool to check if your ads are showing without impacting those metrics and then it's also great to just verify that your ads are showing and make sure there's no issues so sometimes there could be like a keyword conflict a negative keyword conflict or a location targeting issue just depending on like how you're setting up your account it's just always good to go in there and verify that your ads are showing so I'll go ahead and show you how to do that. And just a couple of notes is that this is only for the Google search network. So this isn't for the Google display network. And it's only gonna show the ad in one format, just because depending on the device size, like the mobile device size or the desktop device size, your ad might show a little bit differently or in multiple you know, different kind of uh, variations and formats. This is just gonna give you one format. And before you do this, you want to make sure that if you know you just enable the campaign, you want to make sure your ads are already reviewed and approved. So yeah, we'll go ahead and hop into it. Uh, I'll show you in a client account and how you navigate to it. So you're going to go to the tools section and then under troubleshooting, you'll go to the ad preview and diagnosis. And then you're going to search for a keyword that you want to see showing and you're gonna put in the location, the language, and you can adjust between desktop, mobile, or tablet devices. I have it on desktop here. And then if you have a particular audience that you wanna test this for, like a, a, a custom audience uh, or a, a retargeting audience, you can also add that in. And so I have the keyword I wanna search, and then I just searched it already, and it shows if your ad is showing, you're gonna get the screen your ad is showing here. And then you can scroll down. I'm gonna blur this out just because it's a client's account, but if I scroll down, I can actually see that the ad is highlighted in green here, that uh, it is showing for this particular search. So I'll go ahead and show you an example of when the ad doesn't show. I'll put in another location. Okay, so when I put it in for New York, it shows that your ad is not showing. So some of the reasons here, it says this keyword is not triggering an ad because another keyword is identical to the search term or it's spell correction. So the keyword that's showing here is not the one that I put in here. It's gonna show um, some of the keywords in your account. I see the, the keyword that um, I put in is actually in this third row. And it says this keyword is not triggering an ad. Ads to appear on Google right now due to low ad rank. Uh, ads are ranked based on your bid and ad quality. So here is, I know this account, we have a really low spend and low target CPAs that we're using. So it's probably not showing, it's not showing 100% of the time just because we have low bids, so if we look in the campaign and look at our search impression share, the search impression share for this keyword is actually pretty, this campaign is actually pretty low just because we're not spending a lot. So, but at least we're not seeing any like conflicts or anything that's causing a, a problem. Obviously we could increase the budget and the bid and make sure we're, you know, testing high quality creatives, but just because it's not appearing right now doesn't mean it could appear if I continue to like to try to search on this. So um, yeah, that's pretty much it. It's a great tool to use to check your ads and they also have this anonymous ad preview tool, which you can use without signing in. This isn't gonna give you the diagnosis information that we just were looking at, but you can use it to search a keyword and then see what, what ads look like on the search results and see if your ads show. So that's another way to do it there, but you're not gonna get that, diagnose, uh, that the diagnosis information. If you have any questions on that, be happy to answer them in the comment section. So just leave a comment if you would like, and thanks for watching and have a great day.